Hi, I'm Steve Jones and I'm going to show you how to calculate the volume of a rectangular prism. Here's our rectangular prism. As you know, a prism has the same cross section when cut at any place in any direction. So this is a rectangular prism. The height is h, the perpendicular height. The width is w and the length is l. Remember, all of these are right angles at this corner. These are all right angles and the, the whole thing is completely square. Now, the volume is very simple to calculate. What we need to do is calculate the base of the prism, the width times the height, and then multiply it by the length. So the base area multiplied by the length. Here's the base area, the width times the height, and we multiply it by the length. Now we've got some values here, let's put them in and see how it works. So the volume is equal to the length, the length here is 6 centimetres, multiplied by the width, the width here we said is 4 centimetres, multiplied by the height, which we've said here is 3 centimetres. These are numbers chosen to give a simple result. Okay. So 6 times 4, 4 sixes are 24, and 3 times 24 is 72. So that's 72 centimetres. Now remember, centimetres cubed it's going to be. It's a volume. The reason is it's cubed because we have three dimensions. In one dimension, it's a length. That's in centimetres. Two dimensions, centimetres squared. It's an area. Three dimensions, centimetre cubed. So that simply is how to calculate the volume of a rectangular prism.